Hello, everyone. What's up? Huh? I think they're new. I've never seen them. Harry. Yes, she's been here. How are you doing? Oops. What did you do? Oops, I don't know. Let's see if the notifications go out. Shout out to Carrie. First one in the house. Hi, Ronald Daly. Hi, Gary. Hi. Be sure to smash that like button as soon as you get in. I didn't get a notification. Hey. I know I didn't get a notification either, so. Or maybe I didn't get one, but you didn't get one yet? No. So I don't think my notifications are going out, guys. Thomas, hi. Hi, Thomas. Hi, baby cornball. Baby cornball. <laughs> Hi, Terrell. Thank you guys for being here. Hi, Kathy, Kelly, Lisa Howard. Hey, I missed you last week. Well, it shows Hi, that Raymond. You're live, but it, it didn't send me a notification. Uh, and I don't Hi, know Justin. Why. Hi, Gary. Let's see. Ray, Amy, Tammy, Robin, Thomas. Yes, smash that like button. Come on, guys, go smash it now while you're in here. Make those likes go up. Howdy, y'all. Howdy, Just Raymond. It. Raymond said, Howdy, y'all. Hi. Hi, Joy. Hi, Amy, Nick, Kelly. Let's see. Is it Daphne? Am I saying that right? Delphine. Delphine? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm definitely not good with names. Hi, Hi Mil Millie's. Amelia. Oh, oh, okay. Hi, Danielle. Raymond. A New York buddy. Marcus. Smash that like button. I just did. Hi, Marcus. Marcus Life Adventure, guys, is my grandson. Check him out. He needs to start Hi, making Wendy. more videos. Hi, O dog. O dog. Attack the like button. I think that's what he meant. What is it? Put a rack, but I think he meant attack the like button. Attack the like button. Yes. Attack it. Break it. Make it so she gets a million likes. Just kiss it. Wouldn't that be amazing? Yeah, it would be really amazing. I hope you guys had a wonderful week. I plan on making some more soon. Good, Marcus. That's awesome. Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Linda. Yeah, go buy some stuff from Tuesday. Oh, Donnie the Traveler. I haven't seen you for a while. I hope you're doing okay. I've been thinking about you. Thank you so much for the donation. Let me write Donnie down. Um, tonight, we're going to be reading out of the tarot cards. These are Henriette's cards. Yay. And all donations will go above the list. I'm going to do a few people. And then um, everyone who donates can will get um, a reading from Henriette. Oh. Donnie, I got your name down. Um, I'm going to have her do a, um, a group card first. And then, Donnie, you'll be the first, first individual card read. Thank you so much for the donation. I appreciate that. You don't know how much it helps. Thank Hi, Amanda. Hi, Joanne. I just see. I just seen Joanne, didn't I? Hi, yeah. Joanne. Shout out to all of you guys. Thank you so much for being here. Smash that like button. Really, Millie's? Where's that at? Is that local? Oh, I did? Okay, Gary. Thanks for correcting me. <laughs> Sometimes I don't remember who I said hi to. Well, I guess we're as ready as we're going to be. It's not going to be a Christmas <laughs> like before, but this whole year has been crazy. Um, yeah, the whole year has been really crazy. So, yeah, I guess, you know. We're ready as we're going to be. This whole virus crap would go away. That'd be fantastic. Hi, Tree Kelly. Yeah. You want to hold that up? Sure. That's the group card. Here's the group card, guys. What does it say? The world. Oh, the world. 
Completion Achievement Unity, Finito, a long-term goal has been reached, and you can now sit back and relax. All of the pieces have come together, and you have finally found your place in the world. Celebrate. This is a huge win. Take pleasure and look back on all the progress that you have made from when you first started. Feel proud? Well, you should. It's amazing how much we can achieve when we put our minds to it. There is an acceptance to yourself and others that creates wholeness and unity. You are realizing that you are part of something much larger than yourself and are able to see the big picture much more clearly. With endings come new beginnings. The world could also literally mean that you will be traveling and will experience a new world wherever you decide to adventure. The world is your oyster. I am shaking. I don't know why. Oh, wow. It's the coffee. It's the coffee. Crap. That was an awesome group card. Uh, yeah. Really, really awesome group card. Tonight, I'm going to be reading a few of my second level members and um, um, anyone who donates. So if you want a reading, you need to donate. And then um, the, all the donations and readings will go to the top of the list. So the first one we're going to read is Donnie the Traveler. Millie, if you go down to where the comments are, there's a money sign. If you hit that, you can donate. Millie lives in Maryland. Frederick, I know where that is, Mar Millie. Sugar loaded, yeah. <laughs> I haven't had coffee from Duncan forever, so that's probably why. Yeah, probably. Crap. All right, Donnie the Traveler is getting the first card. I'm used to my Keurig coffee. That's not like, boom. I drink half calf or decaf because I can't handle the caffeine. Oh, thank you so much, Raymond. It was so much fun. I've done several, several videos. I just have to get them edited and get them scheduled to come out. If you guys haven't checked out the um, do it yourself videos on MLB and me, um, somebody can post that link. Thank you, Robin. And um, go over there and check it out. I will have videos coming out every other day of different um, decorating my house and of um, or making homemade ornaments, different things. So go over and check out MLB and me. Um, Lisa, can you post that link? Hi, Gordon. Thank you so much. There is my other channel. If you're not a, uh, if you're not subscribed to MLB and me, go subscribe and um, be sure to hit that, you know, hit that like button in the videos. Leave me a comment over there. Let me know you've joined that channel. Somebody I appreciate that. Okay, so let's go back and see. Robin, thank you so much, Robin. All right, the first card's for Donnie the Traveler. This is a really good card. That was hot when I pulled it. All right, Donnie, this is your card. Camille's support, wealth, and legacy. Accomplishment and completion. You've reached a point of success on your journey, facing challenges and overcoming them. The foundation for achievement has been laid, and you are now able to kick back, relax, and enjoy your efforts. Contributing your time and talents to your community is appreciated, and they are more than willing to support you back. Legacy and tradition are important to you, so that you are still able to make an impact after you're long gone. Whether that means making sure your loved ones are provided for, creating work a work of art that will withstand the test of time, you are making a statement of who you are and what you, you stand for. Wealth circles around you holistically, continually supporting you with love, community, and stability. Oh, she became a member. Millie's became a member. Thank you so much. No, we didn't, Ray. Robin donated Thank again. You, Thank Robin. you, Robin. I got you on the list. Did you finish reading that? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. All right, here you go. <laughs> that card was that card was for Robin, right? No, that was for Donnie. Donnie the Traveler. Okay, so that card was for Donnie. Hi. Thank you so much for the donation, Donnie. Zia, um, hi, Chris. Thank you. Oh, hi, Millie's. Thank you so much. The next one on the list is is um Robin. We're gonna read hi, for Chris. Robin. Thank you so much for the donation, Millie's. Instant coffee. You got me to buy that, and that stuff's actually really good. And thank you so much for joining the membership. That's thank so you, awesome. Oh, thank you, Amy. Thank you guys for supporting her. It means a lot. I appreciate that. Hi, Tammy Burns. Hi, Rick. Ooh, this one. Hi, new here. Oh, awesome. Ooh. Thank you for being here, Rick. I appreciate that. 
Sounds like me. Thank you. Donnie said it sounds like him. You're welcome, Donnie. You're Hi, welcome. Joy. That's a good card. What's it say? The magician. The magician. This card is for Robin. Intuitive manifestation and true potential. You've got the spark. Creation is the name of the game. Whether you pour your energy into a new life cycle or create a creative project, this is a time of putting in all your resources to manifest your desires. Your toolbox is complete with anything you could ever need. And if it isn't, the right tools will appear exactly when you need them. You're resourceful and constantly find innovation, innovative solutions to problems with grace and ease. The universe has your back and will provide you with the power to manifest your desires in the external world. <laughs> infinite, <laughs> infinite opportunities are available as you continue to flow. Be clear about your intuitions and use them to feel purposeful action. That was a mouthful. The more specific you are, the more you ma magnetize your creative energy and manifest magic. Claim your power. I think I need to hear that too. I was like tingly. Wow. Holy crap. <laughs> Wow, that card oh. was for Robin. That card scares you? Now, this if you, one? If you missed all the, like, your whole reading, if maybe you, I don't know, you turned your head or you went to get a, grab a drink and you missed it, you could always scroll back and listen to your card reading because it'll always be on here. Um, the next one is for Millie's. Thank you so much for becoming a member and thank you for the donation. Millie's will be next. Hi, Mr. Dave. Hey. Haven't seen you for a while either. Oh, Ray, that's okay. You being here and uh, smashing the like button is enough. Hi, Rita. Thank you, Hi, Jan. Hi, Jan Connor. I appreciate that. Hi, Rick Wilson. We have Ray. Let's see. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Hello. Okay, so the next one is for Millie's. Six of Swords in reverse. Six. Oh, almost <laughs> dropped it. Six of Swords, Millie. Or it's 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 Millie's, right? Yeah, it's mm -hmm. Millie's. Six of Swords. Resistance stuck in stagnation. Self sabotage is controlling your actions without you even realizing it. By repelling. Repeating these behaviors, it keeps you stuck in the same place rather than moving forward. No matter how hard you try, the past keeps catching up with you and it's self-defeating, to say the least. Carry emotional baggage. Carrying emotional baggage leaves you heavy with memories you cannot change. Lingering on to the present and influencing the actions you take in the future, fear of the unknown keeps you safe, even though it's stagnant. The Six of Swords reverse is a gentle reminder that change is good and encourages you to be brave during this transition. It will open doors you didn't know existed, but you have to trust the process. Open yourself up and allow yourself to, to transition into a new place. Holy crap. Wow. These are like really good cards. Tonight. They are really good Whoa. cards. That card was for Millie. Raymond, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Yeah, it, it's it's emotional every time I go there. You know, I just try to stay strong. It's it's hard. I wish, you know, I was young. I was, I think I just turned 21. I was really young when I lost my, my mother. And then I lost my father four days later. It was awful. It was a nightmare. I packed my bags and left the state and stayed gone for 30 years. So, um, yeah, it, it was it was hard. It was very hard. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Someone's in the hospital. Oh no! I don't know. I might did I out. miss it? I think so. So keep her in your prayer. Oh, Amanda Seaman, who's in the hospital? Oh, I'm so oh, I'm sorry for my friend. Her mom is. Oh, oh, okay. I am so sorry, Amanda. This virus needs to go away. I How is your know. family doing, Amanda? Since your sister passed, I've still got you guys in my prayers. Thank you, Wendy. Oh, thank you, Wendy. I appreciate that. You don't have to be silent. We're not silent. <laughs> you can speak up. Ace of Swords, remember? Ace of Swords. This one is for Amy J. Amy J. Confusion, headcase, disarray. 
pure chaos, your mind is scattered and you are unable to focus. Thoughts flow around your headspace with no way of grounding themselves into concrete ideas. Your mind is spinning with so many conflicting thoughts that you are considering that you can't get away with. Living inside your mind for too long is tainting your sense of what is real and what is not. This is time for you to get an outside opinion so that you can gain some clarity. Trusted friends and family will offer, offer their opinions, but the choice is ultimately yours. It's time to get your head out of the clouds and get clear on what you want. Be as specific as possible with depicting your dream scenario. Act with precision and your decisions. A mind is a terrible thing to waste, especially yours. Wow. <sighs> That one was for Amy Johnson. Oh my! These cards. Let are us like know if these crap. cards are making sense for you. No, I think that um, Millie's is Amelia. Um, it's going to be hard for me to remember that unless you post it every time. Mm -hmm. But um, thank you so much. Um, she says, "You're welcome." Let's see. It says you have no idea right now the situation I'm in, and I and blah, 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 blah. And I really tells me a lot. Thank you. I guess the card was really meant, meant a lot to her. Stay strong. You are it's so okay. welcome. You are so welcome. Am I in trouble with you? For what? Someone just asked if I was in trouble. Why? Because I did the 30 minute alone. Yeah, well, she's an adult and I can't make her do something she don't want to do. I'm safe, um, I promise. Like I've said before, I if I don't have somebody to go with me, I go out and do it myself by myself too. So, you know, we all do it. I, you know, I I make sure that my surroundings is good before I go into doing I something all along. And I'm sure she does the same thing. I did. She told me I drive around and I make sure no one's in there. That's what you have to do a couple of times. Yeah. Just to it's make still sure. It's scary though. It is scary. It's very scary. It's like. Because you don't know yourself, if somebody's you walking out. You and you're like, mm -hmm. oh crap. Hi, Barbara Long. I've only ran twice. Because I panicked. Hi, Sherry Knotts. Shout out to my members. I have a lot of members in here tonight. Shout out to all of you guys. Um, the next one I'm going to read is, let's see. I don't know if I've seen her in here. I'm going to read Sherry Knotts. Okay, so we'll do Sherry Knotts. I don't know if I've seen her either. I thought Sherry's I here. I've okay. seen Sherry. I, I wrote down a few of my second level members that I want to read. And um, I don't see some of them in here. So we'll do Sherry first. Oh, hello. It is scary, Robin. It really is. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's funny. We're okay, the so what is it now? Hold on. Queen, queen of, of pentacles, pentacles in reverse. Let's queen of pentacles. Down. Well, they want to see what it looks like I this know, way. I know, but that's how it... Um. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Workaholic smothering isolation. All work and no play. You may be immersed completely in your career right now, working hard to provide for your family, which ironically is also taking quality time away from your loved ones. You are experiencing overwhelm, struggling to juggle your career and home life, and are feeling inadequate in the process. Return to a place to rejuvenate your juices and ground yourself to your center. Balance is the key for sustainability for both your health and your sanity. If you are questioning your ability to be financially independent, trust your gut instincts. You don't have to work yourself down to the bone in order to achieve that goal for yourself and your family. Take a step back and see where you can spend less time and control. Work smarter, not harder. Wow, that card oh. was for Sherry Knotts. That was an awesome card. Amy says, I get scared for y'all yeah. and yell at y'all like you can hear me. <laughs> we hear you, Amy. We hear don't you. We just, we just don't, don't listen. Do <laughs> we hear you. It's like watching a scary movie and you're like, don't open that door. Don't go in there. I know that um, like when she does the 30 minutes, she, she brings me my, she, like she uses my other camera. Um, my cell phone, my, she used my other cell phone and she'll bring me back the cell phone and say, Hey, there's two or three videos on there. So I pull them videos off. And when I'm editing it, like I was editing one last night, I was scared. <laughs> I was scared for her. And I knew that she handed me the phone like, and I'm she okay. was okay. But you know, it's crazy. She'll go out and do these things and she won't say nothing until after she's done it. And then she comes and hands me my phone and says, Hey, you want to take them off there so I can make some more. 
Like, oh my God. Well, I don't want you to panic either. But I was editing one last night and it was really scary. <laughs> it was really scary. Oh my goodness. It seems like when I'm alone, that's when they mess with me the most. Like, Come on, don't do this. Yeah, it's really scary. <laughs> okay, so that card was for, ah, sorry, ah. for Sherry Knotts. The next one is going to be for Joanne. Joanne's still here. I can't do scary stuff. I would literally freak out and run the other direction. Oh, I know. I, I ran out twice in Florida Hills, so. I don't like, um, I can't even watch scary movies. I don't know how I'm doing oh, this. Oh, I'm so sorry. What happened? Our son died. Hi, Lisa. Oh, I'm sorry, Kathy. That's, that's Haley's birthday, GBD. the day your son died. I am so sorry. Joanne's here. Yay. Hi, Julie. Huh? Who am I pulling for? You're pulling for, for Joanne. Okay. That's what I thought. Yeah. Hi, Lena. Tonight, I'm just doing my second level members. And um, if you, um, I'm doing, anyone who donates will go to the top of the list. This one, if someone's got to hear that. That one was just out. Yeah. Someone needs to hear that. What is it? Six of what? Six of swords. Six of swords, guys. This one is for Joanne. Resistance, stuck, and stagnation. Self-sabotage sabotage is controlling your actions without you even realizing it. By repeating these behaviors, it keeps you stuck in the same place rather than moving forward. No matter how hard you try, the past keeps catching up with you and it's self-defeating, to say the least. Carrying emotional baggage leaves you heavy with memories you cannot change, lingering onto the present and influencing the actions you take in the future. Fear of the unknown keeps you safe, even though it's stagnant. The Six of Swords reverse is a gentle reminder that change is good and encourages you to be brave during this transition. It will open doors you didn't know existed, but you have to trust the process. Open yourself up and allow yourself to transition to a new place. That felt like I got electrocuted when I touched wow, that. Wow, really? Yeah. Dang. Okay. <laughs> That card was for Joanne. Joanne, hopefully that made sense to you. Awesome. Oh, my goodness. What'd she say? Because when I seen her, she was standing there wearing her. That's amazing. Oh, wow, Amanda. That's pretty Whoa. cool, though. That is pretty cool. Talk to her. Talk to her out loud like she's still there. Uh, maybe she'll show you, ask her to show you some signs that she's still there with you. She'll do things around the house. That's pretty awesome. Totally for her. Joanne said it was totally for her. Awesome, Joanne. I felt like she needed that. Yes. That's probably why it was like electric when I touched it. Sometimes I do, Millie. Sometimes. Um... The next one is going to be for Lisa Howard. Lisa Howard. Hi, Vanessa. Hi, Vanessa. I have her at the, on my list, too. Vanessa, you're on my list. I just didn't see you in here yet. So that one's for Lisa. What is it? Nine uh, of Pentacles? Yep. Lisa Howard, Nine of Pentacles. What was that? Sound like a growl or something. That did. <laughs> okay. I think the door is closed. I know, right? <laughs> Hi, Lisa Hazard. Hi, Nancy. True colors, splendor, and vitality. Indulge yourself. You deserve it. Your hard work is paying off, and you are now reaping the rewards. You feel at ease with your financial status, income, and schedule. Live love with luxury, allowing yourself to enjoy the abundance that you've created. It is now time to celebrate and treat yourself, whether it's buying the item you've had your eye on or giving yourself time to rest. By staying true to yourself and your vision, you are improving the quality of your life. Show your true colors by saying yes to your independent spirit and the creations you are bringing forth into this world. Acknowledge your accomplishments and what it took for you to get to this place of fulfillment and satisfaction. Rich in inspiration, connect and replenish the unique beauty that you possess and provide in this world. Wow. These cards are like, That was whoa. a good card for Lisa. Lisa Howard, that was your card. 
I hope that um, that card made sense to you. I know some of it made sense to me really for you. So I, let us know. Vanessa, beautiful card. Yes. All right, so I have Vanessa back up here. Um, we, we passed over her because Hi, she Terry. wasn't here. Vanessa, the next card is for you. You're welcome. Hi, Terry Azell. Frogman? That's pretty cool, Amanda. Oh, is Gary leaving us? Four of Wands. Good night, Gary. All right, what is it? The Four of Wands. All right, this card is for Vanessa. The Four of the Four of Wands. Instability, uncertainty, and flightness. Home may be the last place you want to be right now. Instability inside domestic environments can leave you feeling insecure within your place in relationships and spaces. Communication is out of sync, and no matter how hard you seem to try, translations get lost the more you attempt to explain yourself. This is an un uncertainty of where your future will lie and where you will end up next. Commitment is going to be a struggle, so don't expect it from a new relationship. If this is you... Be easy on yourself and give yourself space to decide if this person feels like home, fight or flight. The, cho the choice is up to you. I cannot talk at all. <laughs> in your heart, you know you must move on to more stable ground. If this does not improve, the energy is unstable and you deserve solid ground. Wow. That card was for Vanessa. Thank you so much, Sarah. Hi, Joy Callahan. Oh. I wasn't ignoring you, honey. Amy like, said, thank you for the reading. It hit home. Awesome, oh. Amy. That is so awesome. Sir, that Why do I want to listen to Meatloaf, the singer, when I can see you ladies together? Ah, oh, thank <laughs> you. Meatloaf is pretty good, though. I like Meatloaf. <laughs> the band? The band. Really? Yes, really. <laughs> it was my day. It wasn't your day. Well, I don't know. I mean, <laughs> I've heard their stuff, but it just doesn't seem like Hi, Sarah. That was like the sweetest thing anyone has ever said to me. Aw. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, no. Let's see. What did I miss? What did you say oh, no to? My computer went out during oh, the power outage. That's not good. No. Let's see. Sometimes you're not expecting. Okay. So the next one that we're reading is going oh, to be did. for um, Thomas. Let's read Thomas. Oh, Thomas. The whole deck just vibrated when you said Thomas. That's meatloaf is weird. awesome. The meatloaf food and the meatloaf ban. <laughs> I really like meatloaf if you make it. I just made meatloaf I like know. last week. Anyone who would like to become a member, Thomas just posted the link. Um, you, you're not obligated when you hit that when you hit that button. You just go in and check out the different levels and see if it's for you. Um, I appreciate that. Tonight I'm reading a few of my second level members and um, a few, um, everyone who donates. So if you donate, you'll go to the top of the list. Three of Wands. Three of Wands in reverse. There is poor planning and obstacle. Obstacle after obstacle has left you feeling frustrated and apprehensive. You can see the big picture. However, there are blocks along the way. Plans will not with not only a timeline, but a deadline have been thrashed, which ends up feeling like time wasted. In constant state of overwhelm, you are thrown off your game and unable to adjust to the challenges that have come your way. This could also have happened due to poor planning and shaky foundations. Take your losses for what they are and align yourself back to your grand vision. Ask yourself what tiny steps you can take today so that you are much closer to achieving what you have dreamed for yourself. This is a part of the journey and you have all the resources necessary to overcome your struggles. Okay. For these cards. That's these awesome. These are pulling really good cards. That card was for Thomas. Now, what did she say? Meatloaf isn't a band? That's the name of a band. He's a solo artist. Oh, well. I like Meatloaf. You're welcome, Thomas. Sweet dreams, Gary. <laughs> oh, he's leaving? He left. Oh, he's hi. gone. Hi. Let's see. All right, so the next one, that one was for Thomas. The next one we're going to read is going to be for Lisa Hazard. Lisa Hazard. Eight 
Angie's doing okay. She is not going live tonight, guys. She will not be live tonight. Work is, what, what did she tell me? Oh, Sarah, what happened? Let, let me see what she said to me. I don't know what's going on, but we'll pray for you. Hi. She said, work is kicking my ass, and I was too tired. <laughs> oh. She's working her butt off, guys. <laughs> She's not getting enough sleep. So she was really, really tired. It's Christmas. I think we all are. <laughs> What is it? It's this one. Okay, so you were reading Lisa Hazard. Oh, hello. Hello. That's a King of Wands. In your face card. You'll see what I mean. Come on. Natural leader, visionary, and entrepreneur. A true visionary, the King of Wands lights fire to his ideas with finesse and intention. His enterprising nature is able to fully flesh out an idea from beginning to end. Passion rules his kingdom, where his visions have the purpose of impacting the world on a large scale. He is able to both lead and follow, delegating tasks effectively while simultaneously working alongside his team. His greatest wish is to empower those around him to inspire them to be the best that they can be. He molds the world into his ideas, supported by others who believe in his vision. Direct and straight to the point, the King of Wands asks you to create goals for yourself with clarity and imagination. Lead your life with intent and vision, with your eye on the prize. Don't stop until you get to where you need to go. Wow. Yeah. Hi, Barbara Paver. That last card was for Lisa Hazard, right? Uh, yes. Lisa Hazard. <laughs> yes. Awesome. I'm trying to see if I missed any comments. I have no idea. Something Sarah said something and people are saying it praying for her. I don't, I don't know. What Thank she you, said Thomas that. and Lisa, for posting the links. I appreciate that so much. We missed it. Mm-hmm. Hi, Lee. Hi. Don't you owe, we owe Lee yeah. a card, right? How Do we owe her three cards? You're going to have to read Lee three cards. All okay. right, Lee, we're going to read your cards live that we owe you. So Hi. it's a three card. I think it was a three card um, spread. So you're going to pull three cards and read them for? Okay, so we guys, we owed Lee some cards for, from a while back Jessie. that we never got to her. Hi. So Lee's going to get the next three cards. Who is it? Jesse? Yeah, Jesse. Jesse. Jesse's Paranormal Adventures, guys. That is my sister. You guys go over and subscribe to her. She's my sister from another mister. I love her. Um, I love you. She's an awesome person. <laughs> she is. I've definitely. seen your video, and I love you, but if you would have fallen on your butt, I would have laughed. <laughs> oh, no, Linda Sammons. Thank oh. you for letting me know what she said. Because we couldn't find it. Thank you so much. I am Whoa. so sorry, Sarah. There's Jesse's channel, guys. If you're not subscribed to Jesse, go subscribe to her. She is awesome. She makes really good content. She's got a lot of good videos and she puts energy into editing and everything. She does good. I'm proud of her. Wait till Lee hears these cards. Holy uh oh. Crap. All right, these cards are for Lee. They're, they're not bad, but. Ah, Juanita. <laughs> Juanita. So Hi, Juanita. Okay, so the first one is Ace of Swords. All right, Lee, these are your cards. Ace of Swords is your first card. Clarity, pure, pure power, and breakthrough. Cutting straight through the bullshit. The Ace of Swords delivers truth and clarity in realistic ways. Your potential is at an all-time high. Eyes and clearly see... Your mind is razor sharp and able to handle any task that comes your way. After experiencing through with your experiences, you are armed with a new worldview and perspective, which allows you to access your creativity and its truth seeker. You are prepared to fight for justice with the fire and intensity of your sharp intellect. With great power comes great responsibility. Weld your sword with care as it carries plenty of influence. Wow. Yeah, she she got some good cards. What's the next one you're reading? This one? Uh, yes, the Five of Swords in Reverse. Five of Swords is your next card, Lee. 
Forgive and forget. Amends conflicts. Conflict about intention, causing unnecessary unnecessary stress and anxiety. So we're lagging. To uh oh. Yeah. Let me plug it into the to the hard wire. Um, we might have to like switch sides for a second. Okay. Or hold on one second, Lee. Let me plug it in so I don't lag. I'm sorry. No, I know. Right. I know. I'm sorry. Okay. I gotta find the damn thing back there. It's behind you guys. I can't can't feel the right. I can't feel the hole. <laughs> oh my god! I know, right? Well, shit fire. <laughs> I'm trying to find it. Where the hell is it? I don't know. I gotta turn the thing around. I can't find it, guys. No. Not that you're gonna find. There, I got it. I heard click. I got oh, it. You moved the whole thing. It's okay. I can tilt it back. Tilt it back. Okay. All right, guys. Shit. Hopefully, it won't lag now because now we're hardwired. Okay. I usually I have my other my other. Oh, I'm hot. Oh, hot. I have my other computer <laughs> hardwired because I edit on it all the time. So, and then I'm live on this computer. Oh, come but, on, Jesse. Okay. So, See, she did it. Yeah, <laughs> awesome, Jesse. That's right. It is. All right. So, you need to me. start over okay, what's on that this card one? because I goofed it up because it, we were lagging <laughs> and I didn't. Well, something's in the way. There we go. Whoa. I didn't want to lag. Um, okay, so Lee, your second card, we're starting over with it. It's Five of Swords. Forgive and forget, amend conflict. Conflict has got you all tangled up in intention, causing unnecessary stress and anxiety. Be ready to forgive and forget so that you can leave the drama behind once and for all. If this is providing to be a burden, remember to take care of yourself first. It, that tweaked me out. <laughs> it's okay to be selfish at times. Protect your magic so that you have more to give. Being full of yourself simply means owning your gifts. There is a need to prove yourself and that you are right. Don't waste your energy trying to make people validate your opinions. All you need is a stamp of approval from yourself. Patterns of conflict may be following you, signifying unresolved issues from the past. Heal those core wounds by driving deep into your subconscious. Only then will you be able to fully move forward. Oh, awesome. Okay, that was Lee's second card. I was trying to read these comments. Uh, it's, they're saying that we're blurry. It just looks like... Looks like an alien in your face. Really? I already did that. I already wiped that. I wonder why. I mean, I, it's hardwired now, so I oh, don't look. know. What? You see it? It looks like something's on top of your face. Well, I don't know what the hell it that is. is I don't see anything now. I don't know, but earlier before you got here, I went to Grace. I went to Grace. Are you kidding me? No, I went and did the um the tube. Oh my god, the ghost tube. I went to the cemetery that me and Juanita went Why to. Why did you do that? Because I was it, I was trying to get there before dark, but that didn't work. Go away. Um, <laughs> I I went there earlier, guys, and I did um the ghost tube inside that oh, mausoleum, no. and I got like six figures. And, um, they better stop messing with I stuff. kept getting, it was hot and I kept getting chills. I kept thinking, Oh God, please don't, don't attach to me. I don't know if something tried to attack. Maybe something did attach to me tonight. Oh, is it any better? We're distorted. I'm distorted. It's just me, right? It's on you. Well, I could be from, I went to the mausoleum earlier. Did you pick that up? <laughs> my selenite yeah. stick. Go away. My return to sender. Stick that thing down my shirt. <laughs> In your treasure chest. In my treasure chest. We don't know what's going on with I the camera. I need these too. All right, uh, let me put them down. You might as well too. just put all of them down your shirt. Oh, that's enough. Is that lady okay? Her? Uh, now we're both distorted. What is going on? I don't know what's going on, guys. I don't know why. You guys were hardwired. Now it should be fine. Let's see. Both, but they said it's on you more. It doesn't make sense. Oh, we gotta sage you. Why? I don't know, because if something bad's here, it needs to go. I know, away. but away, I don't away. know. There's nothing in here, guys. I got some holy water. I'm gonna spray that too. Got some holy water. Yeah. 
Leave us in the name of Jesus. Yeah, go away. Get away from us. All spirits must leave us. It's on my face, right? Yeah. Is it still there? I don't, I don't know, know guys. Behind. I don't know. That's crazy. I had holy water. Um, Raymond says it's the, the connection. I just hardwired it. It should be like hooked up. It shouldn't have any. Maybe your internet provider is working on something. Maybe. I don't know. Should I unplug it again? Do you think that's going to make a difference? You guys said that. Um, oh, I'm having a hot flash. Holy crap. Oh, my God. Let me close this computer. That way the internet will go off on that one. Robin's comment. But if um, you were breaking up on my end, I don't, I don't understand. Might be the internet connection problem. Uh, if I reboot, I lose you guys. Um, okay, well, this is well, Hold on. This is, this is Lee's third card. Can, Leah, can you hear us so we can read your third card? It is... What does it say? The Hierophant. The Hierophant. Like, holy crap. Yeah. Hi. Blinded by the light. <laughs> this is Lee's third card. Oh, we want to no. try to read this card to her, but if we're, if we're, um, okay, she can hear yeah. you. Go ahead. Conventional institution tradition. Stay woke. The Hierophant calls you. To honor the tra traditions in your life, whether large or small, honoring rituals can help you feel grounded. At this time, you are drawn towards joining a group, community, or organization. What was that? That has certain rules you'd have to follow. By joining these groups, you will broaden your scope and expand your knowledge. Strength in numbers allows you to feel a sense of acceptance, unity, and identity. Look to your lineage of ancestors or religion to shine light on the wisdom of the past. The Hierophant guides you on your spiritual journey through unity and community rituals with rules and structure in societies. Be prepared to absorb as much information as you can. Higher learning leads to a better understanding of your higher self. I told you it was going they to be They said it's reading. clearing up. Um, it's really weird, though. I was trying to see it on my other computer. I opened it back up. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I don't know why, guys. I can't even explain oh, it. Oh, God. <laughs> Um, unless I brought something there. home today, but you know, I went out earlier oh. and, um, cause I wanted You're to do that me. and yeah, it's bad. I've been wanting to go back there and so, I don't know. Oh, I was just, just happened there. to be out. So, um, <laughs> I don't know. Look at that. It's, that's awful. And I'm on a good computer. I mean, I'm not even on a cheap We computer. can't even see it on your computer. They're seeing it. No, but I can see it on that computer, but I don't see nothing on this computer. It's crazy. Yeah, it's bad. It's mostly on you. It looks it like is. something's on top of you. On my oh face. Oh, my God. I don't know, guys. Hi. If, um, if it's too aggravating, I can just end my live stream. I don't have any birds at home. Yeah, I'm going to sage both of us. Hi, April. Hi, Terry. I wasn't with her, though. Yeah, well, I might have already brought it home and put it on you. It might be on you, too, now. Oh, well, then I'm oh, going to sage both you'll, of us. Oh, you look evil. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, shit, fire. Okay, who's next? We look evil. I don't know if we don't if they don't have a I good picture. Not. They might not even. See, on my computer in front of me, we look perfectly clear. It's your autofocus. Some people are saying it's fine, and other people are saying it's not. See, Rick says it's fine. Yeah. I don't know what that means on a, on a computer. I'm on a I'm on a desktop with a uh, I'm on an Apple desktop with the webcam. I guess it's just a bad connection. Should I unplug it and see? Oh, look, we look clear now. A lot of, more than. Like half of them are saying it's okay. It's all okay now. Okay, well we're gonna just hang, leave it on there. All right, so we finished reading. Okay. Lee, right? Yes. Okay, awesome. I told you she was gonna get some good cards. Awesome. <laughs> okay, so the next one we're gonna read is going to be for um for Barbara Barbara Paver. She likes your white tree. 
Awesome. I like my white tree, too. I got too many Christmas trees. Well, you've been talking about it, so I figured I would surprise you. I thought she was going to be real mad. Millie, Millie, or Amelia, you'll have to contact me on Messenger. Ouch. You're welcome. Awesome, Barbara. I'm glad it's better now. Um, Barbara, the next card is for you. I don't know what happened. You guys said it was oh. glory, so I plugged it in. What is this one? Seven of Pentacles. That's a good card, too. Look at that, Barbara. Patience, investment, and sustainability. Hard work pays off. The seeds have been planted, and you are now starting to see the fruits of your labor. Like a badass, you are looking towards the future with long-term strategy, putting effort into investments for the best returns. Timing is key for the sustainability of your ventures, cultivating your ideas with the care they deserve. This isn't just about money. This is about passion. You're putting blood, sweat, and tears into something you feel very strongly about, building a foundation for your personal freedom. Your ideas are coming into fruition, visibly growing before your eyes. Patience is key, as this will take some time to manifest the way you envisioned. Now get rich, quick schemes here. You're in, for, in it for the long term. Awesome. That card was for Barbara. The ones that are still seeing it breaking out must be behind. Oh, um, grab the little the little arrow at the bottom of your screen and move it all the way over. To those of you that are behind, I know you might not be hearing it right now. You might hear it in a few seconds or, or a couple minutes. But grab the little arrow at the bottom. You're probably behind in the video because the video is clear now. It was nice. You're welcome. Awesome. That card was for Barbara. Let's see here. Let's read Jesse a card. Yay. Jesse, you're next. She's going to be a good one, too. Is she? Yeah. It, does, it looks bad, but it's not. What is it? Exact judgment. Jesse got judgment. People are always trying to judge us, Jesse. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> oh, Lord. Absolution, evaluation, and reflection. Prioritize reflection and self-evaluation as you need time to regenerate. You've reached a checkpoint where you are, are ready to assess your life and release old wounds. Quiet and contemplation can lead to an awakening that you are ready to change aspects of your life for the better. You'll be able to recognize patterns in the past that may have served you then, but no longer serve you now. Authenticity has become important to you, and you want to live your life aligned with your inner spirit and your truest self. You've learned from the past and are ready to carry those lessons into the future with experience and wisdom. Trust your judgment. You'll make your decisions based on a perfect blend of intuition and intellect. Enhanced by your library of lessons learned from the past experiences, I told you. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, see? Wow, what happened to Lisa? Uh, see, and I never get a notification for your live streams anymore. I didn't get one tonight oh, either. Sometimes you have to unsubscribe and resubscribe and hit the bell. Um, recently, I don't know what YouTube's been doing. I lost a few moderators. You're welcome. And, um, actually, Love they you. were there, but they wasn't able to do what their, their, what their job was. So I had to remove them and put them back. So sometimes YouTube just messes up. I don't know. You might have to unsubscribe and just resubscribe again. <clears throat> Ouch. Dang it. <laughs> okay. So, um, guys, we're going to do a group card for the Buy ending. I'm going to end it for tonight. And um, Nancy says she is behind. Maybe run some sage or something. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> something. Find out why <laughs> that I, you know, I don't know. Hi. I felt like something was trying to attach to me while I was there. Ouch. And um, you guys will see that video. It probably won't come out till the end of December. I have so many videos backed up that I have to be editing. I need to stop filming until I edit them all. But, you know, when you get the opportunity to film, you, you don't, you go do it. You don't stop. So I have a few backed up. Thank you guys all for being here tonight. Thank you all for the donations that you sent in. And my new member, Amelia, 
Shout out to you. And um, we are going to do um, a group card for the end reading. So just pull for everyone. So think of all of you us. Pull it? Yeah, I'll pull it. All right. I don't know. Somebody just told me to hand you the deck. So that's what I did. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This deck's too big to shuffle. I know. <laughs> I know. Like, it's weird. No, it doesn't, Jesse. You know, when, when this uh -huh. th when this virus first started, I had like 18 or 19 videos. And I'll tell you right now, I probably have 21 videos that I you need to get that? editing. Um, some of them are for MLV and me. If you guys are not subscribed to MLV and me, it's Marie's Life Vlogs, just the initials, MLV and me. Um, Lisa and Thomas have the, the link to that. That is my other channel, and I've done some Christmas crafts, Christmas decorating on my, uh, you know, at my house. Um, I have several different videos that'll be going out every other day on that channel, all the way up to Christmas. So if you're not subscribed, go over there and subscribe. Um, hit that like button. Let me know that you're over there. Tornado heard it too. What did you hear? Because he said he heard it when I looked over here. I heard something in your living room. Mm. All right, here you go. I'm not gonna... Again. What is it? Magician. Oh, wow. The magician <laughs> again. That's twice. We've pulled similar cards. Okay. So the magician. Everybody needs to hear this. Smash that like button, guys. I'm going to read it upside down, apparently. Okay. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. Good night, Tammy. Inventive manifestation and true potential. You've got the spark. Creation is the name of the game. Whether you pour your energy into a new life cycle or creative project, this is a time of pulling in all your resources to manifest your desires. Your toolbox is complete with anything you could ever need. And if it isn't, the right tools will appear exactly when you need them. You are resourceful and constantly find innovative solutions to problems with grace, grace and ease. Jeez. The universe has your back and will provide you with the power to manifest your desires in the external world. Infinite opportunities are available as you continue to flow. Be clear about your intentions and use them to fuel purposeful action. The more specific you are, the more you magnetize your creative energy and manifest magic. Claim your power. Wow, that was a really good card. That was really good. Now, Lee keeps hearing birds, and she heard birds when I was at my parents' grave. Now, when I was at my parents' grave, Lee, you might, there might have been birds around there. I might not have paid no attention to that. Um, there's no birds here in my house, though. No. So that's that's pretty cool, though. What does that mean? Does that mean something? Can you tell us if that means something? visiting you? That's nothing a, bad. That's a um, cardinal. Let's see. Just trying to wait and see what that means. If if Lee knows that, what that means, they were loud. Wow, that's what I heard out there. And she don't have birds at all. I hear tweeting too. Wow, no, I mean there's no birds. That's why here. I looked. What? That's why I looked because I heard birds in your living room. And she don't have birds. She has cats and a dog. Yeah, I have cats and a dog. <laughs> um. And it's dark, no. so I don't think birds would be yeah. out now. No. Do no. you have a bird clock? No, I don't have a bird clock either. <laughs> I don't know. I hear Louie walking around out there now. He's got his little chains. Maybe it's his chain on his neck. Oh, wow. That's crazy. I heard it like a faint whistle or mm -hmm. chirp. That's why I keep looking over here because I keep hearing it. You haven't oh. heard that once? I don't know. Louie's trying to say. Louie's out there. No, Louie just like yells across the house. That's what Louie does. Fix my sound. What does that mean, fix my sound? Um, I don't know what, what could be going wrong with my sound. I guess I'll have to rewatch the video just to see just what's sit going here wrong. Because it's doing it again. <laughs> well, Louis barking. I don't, I don't understand. know. I don't hear nothing. Uh, yeah, I don't need a Raven. Happy birthday. <laughs> oh Lord. 
Well, that's okay. That's what Louis does. Louis is trying to sing. Yeah, no, Louis is barking at somebody. It's either a cat in the front yard or or Haley's home. Louis. Chill. All right, guys. I am going to. I don't know how to fix my sound, Samantha. I don't know if it's if, why it's not working or what what's going on. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for being here. Make sure that you guys hit that like button on your way out. If you haven't already hit it, smash that like button. Boy, everybody have a great, great night. I love you. If you want to shout out, say something now. Shout out to Lisa Howard, Thomas, Torna Tornado, Texas. Thank you, Texas. Thomas, Nancy, Ray, Lee. It means danger or a warning. Oh, wow. And I see, I'm not even hearing it. Um, Barbara oh, Paper. Shit. I missed it. Barbara, Drew's Paranormal. Let's see. Chris, Lena, Kathy, Mello. Jesse's Paranormal Adventures, guys. Go check her out. Justin Bear Hicks, Texas, Gordon. Let's see. I'm seeing you Joanne. Shout out Joanne. I don't care. <laughs> I don't need it. It's a, it's a view. Um, hi, Ray. Shout out Ray, Ronald Daly, Robin, Vanessa, Ray again, Thomas again. Good night, everyone. Have a great, great evening. Bye.